restaurant had a secret behind their fridge. People that ate there got sick and never recovered, and the chef seemed happy about it. What are they hiding behind the fridge? Stick around until the end to find out. But this restaurant better be as good as all the reviews were saying it was. It better be. I am literally starving. I know, and I don't normally dress up this fancy, so uh, it took me a lot we of effort. Look good. Thank you. Oh, wait, wait, is this it? Oh my! Okay, it definitely looks fancy. Oh, yeah, all right. Here. It's pretty tight. Yeah, yeah, I got you, I got you. I park. We're good, we're good. Oh, don't worry. Everything's going to be okay. Please get in. What, Dylan, what, what's happening? Is that an EMT? What, like, uh, Yeah, I think that's an ambulance. Wait, what the heck? What is going on? Uh... Okay, yeah, you definitely hear the sirens now. Okay, yeah, babe, that is definitely... Oh, my gosh. Um, an ambulance. Um, I hope nothing happened. Yeah, okay, you know, maybe, maybe that guy slipped and fell on his head uh, or something. You know what? Maybe. That okay, happens, you, you know, just... he was he was grown in, maybe his head hurts. That's you, Valid. Let's just go get some food. Yeah, I don't know, man. I am so freaking hungry. And dude, this restaurant looks so I know, awesome. I know, this place is crazy. Oh dude, look at the vibes. Okay, this Holy. is so nice. It's like still pretty, this is... it's still pretty like interesting. Oh, hello. Hi. We made a reservation, I think. Babe, we'll make a reservation. You made the reservation. I, one reservation for Dylan, please, for two people. I'm uh, so sorry to tell you this, but the restaurant is now closed for the day due to some complications. What? Wait, are you closed? We just got here. Dude, we drove all the way from the other side of town. We didn't get any call or anything. Are you kidding me? We'll be open again tomorrow. You've got to be okay. Oh, well, I mean, like, I guess we're getting fast food for dinner. Oh my I gosh! I put on this whole outfit and everything. I'm upset. I am very, very upset. I wanted food. I wanted. Look at this place. It's so nice. I know, and and I tried so I, I was gonna look fancy, and it was supposed to be really good. And uh, got get all in my the car. Let's up. go. Okay, let's I'm go pick up something fast. Getting in the car. Why am I getting in the back seat? Wait, wait get back here. <sighs> I don't know, but. Don't you think you should be a little more upset if the entire restaurant closed down? <laughs> uh, Pizza Planet it is, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. Don't you think he kind of gave off a weird vibe at the restaurant? What do you or mean? Or is that just me? I don't know. I just feel like he's, he's the head chef. Shouldn't he be a... Uh, or like a worker there? Like, shouldn't he be a little more upset if the entire restaurant closed down? I mean, I guess he kind of had this like weird vibe about him. I don't know. It he just could be kind of kind of smug. Like he was like, yeah, "We are closed, and and we're gonna open tomorrow. So come back." Babe, I I I think it's your stomach. I I think you might just be hungry. I don't know. I think you're reading way too much into this. Maybe, but I don't know. I got a weird vibe from him. He made me mad. <laughs> are you sure we should be here this early? Okay, look. Get this. Maybe. Okay, maybe. We'll get a better table and, you know, we'll have eaten our food before other complications happen I on mean, day I two. Yes. Uh, and, babe, are you really wearing the same thing? Twice? I told really? you, I don't really dress up like this. I only have Look one at me. Thing. I'm yeah. looking like Dapper Dill over here, okay? Yeah, I'm looking it was, fly. You just have fancy stuff collecting dust in your closet, okay? Is it collecting dust if I'm wearing it? For once, I, am, I, I am look not good. I'm buy a lot of things. I'm not going to wear it. You know what? I look good in this dress. Be nice to You me. do look good. Okay, let's go get food. Fine. Come on, come on, come on. Here, here. Gosh. Let me open the door for the lovely lady. Thanks. There you go. See, I'm okay, a gentleman. Here we go with this guy again. What? Why are you being so... Relax, okay? Hi, Hello. uh... Hi, uh... We are... We're back for uh, a reservation. I made a reservation again. What's up, dude? Hello. So glad to see you two again. So glad to be here, mister. Can we sit down and eat, please? Sure, do you have a preference for where you'd like to be seated? I'ma leave that to the picky lady over here, haha. <laughs> um, uh, just this booth is fine. Yeah, I like the booth, the booths are comfy. And they're very spacious, this is nice. Should I sit, I'll sit over here. I'll sit right next to you, cause you know, 
I'm nice and I like what? being around you. Well, I would hope so. <laughs> I want to, okay, part of me de debated sitting all the way across the, uh, on the other side. Well, that would be a little awkward because then I'd have to yell at you to talk in this super fancy restaurant. So if you could please act a little more like you've been in public before. You're okay, I'm sorry. Me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Would you two like to get started with some drinks and appetizers? Or are you ready to order? Uh... uh I, I don't know, Dylan, I, you always order. You just- Can we it. get some calamari and some waters? Good, yep, that's good. That's good. It's, yep, that's that's what we want. We clearly don't come to uh, fancy places very often. I normally dine in Pizza Planet, I'm sorry. Calamari, nice choice. Thank you very much, sir, Thank appreciate you. it. I'll get that and your water to you right away. Well, this is a very accommodating place. This is a nice customer service. Yeah, this is very nice. Okay, he's much better than he was yesterday. Yeah, okay, yesterday maybe was. Maybe I, uh, I'm gonna scoot a little bit closer to you. Oh. Hi. Okay. You are the most clingiest girlfriends. You're so close to me. What, what? the heck? I just I'm gonna move over here. Oh. <laughs> what the heck? That's so funny. I... Oh, oh my. Okay. Oh my God. You are ridiculous. <laughs> okay, okay. Fine. I'll scoot back. I'll scoot back. I just want to be able to sit next to you. Okay. Okay. Look, I am just glad that you and I are finally able to have a date night at this beautiful restaurant. Look okay. At these like. And everything. Oh, I just realized we got an open kitchen concept. You see that guy in there? Right. We get to like see all our food being. Cooked. Yeah. He's prepping. Okay. I like that because that's how you know a place like this is clean. Okay. Like, the restaurant's really nice. I like it a lot. Where is the chef? I need to speak to him right now. Oh, um, what the? Baby, what? you hear that? What? This uh. is so ridiculous. Uh, Carrie? Uh, what is going hey, on hey, with hey, this hey, lady? Hey, scoot over. I want to see. What? Oh, okay, I'm okay, nosy. Okay, okay, okay. I'm nosy. I'm let me, scooting, let me, I'm scooting, I'm let me just scoot, too. Let me just. Oh, Karen. Uh. Karen alert. I'm the chef. This place needs to be shut down right now. Oh. Help? Uh. You hear me? Babe? Oh my Real gosh, life Karen situation. Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm so uncomfortable. uncomfortable. Uh. What kind of restaurant is this? I thought it was supposed to be a fancy one. I don't know. Me too. Why is this lady yelling? I'm, 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 uh. Oh no. Oh no. What? <gasps> Listen here, lady. I'm going to need you to calm down. Gosh. Since when does the workers get angry I don't at the know. customer? I mean, I guess if he like owns the place, he What can... is this lady even mad about? I don't know. Now you listen. You better shut this place down right now for poisoning my poor man. You hear me? Poison? Said... Wait, what? Uh, me? Poisoning your husband? Wait, what the heck? What's going on right now? This is this place is clearly very dramatic. Why would I ever do that? This is a fine establishment. Now you better shut down and pay our medical bills. What? Carrie, this, this conversation is she scary. She wants him to pay their medical bills? Wait, oh, I'm so confused. Wait, oh my gosh. If anything, your bad cooking must have finally caught up to him. What? What the? Burn! Oh Yo, my bro, gosh. Oh, okay, okay. That's, that's a little much. Fine establishment. Yeah, right. Mm. I'm not paying any of your medical bills. What? How dare you? This isn't the last time you'll see of me. And when I come back, you'll be shut down forever. Dylan, um, I don't know if this is necessarily the date night we wanted. No, I'm a little uncomfortable. And I feel like because this guy got really riled up, the food won't taste good. I don't know if I want to be somewhere where he's this angry. Yeah, hey, 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 I got this. Uh, hey, chef, uh, my, uh, my, uh, my, my, uh, uh, beaver is, needs to go to the vet. Uh, Carrie, let's go. Come on. Okay. Move uh, it, lady. Yes, gotta let's go. go. get that beaver. We'll, we'll be back another time. Bye. Bye. I'm not good at lying under pressure. I'm sorry. A beaver? Are you kidding me? You knew we were lying. I don't know. Just get let's out just of here. Go. TV or a book? Hmm. It's probably better to read a book, but I think I'm gonna watch some TV. Hmm. No. 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 Oh. Wait. What? Who the heck just knocked on my door? Uh. Hello? Hi. 
Anyway, you look kind of familiar. Are you by chance the girl that was at Anthony Labar's restaurant the other day? Uh, yes. I, I was, you know, for like, not for very long, though. I knew it! Wait, 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 is this that girl that showed up and caused a crazy scene there? What the heck? How, how did she find my house? Um, uh, come on in, I guess. What can I, um, what can I do for you? I can't believe this. That man poisoned my husband. Uh, oh, okay, I'm really, really sorry about that. Uh, what exactly? How? Wait, what, a, what are you doing here? This is so ridiculous. Mm-hmm, okay, um, yeah. I need your help exposing that awful Anthony. Wait, what? You need my help? What? I, I don't know. I don't know what you're what you're wanting me to do. Yes! Um, okay. Uh, you know, just uh um okay, this girl is uh definitely crazy. I don't even know how she found my house and now she wants me to expose this guy? Uh what? You were there! You saw him! No, I really I I wasn't there for that long, you know. It was uh just it, we we didn't even, you know, we decided to go get burgers. You, you don't believe me, do you? Well, um, it, it's just a complicated situation. Well, uh, no, I mean, that's not exactly, you know, what I meant. Well, uh, you know, maybe, it, it, you know, if we just, you know, talk to him or something, you know, poisoning is kind of a big thing. Oh. <laughs> Oh gosh. Oh gosh, she's crying. Uh okay, I got cup. I guess I need a cup for her. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, you know what? It's fine. Everything's fine. Uh, 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 I just have to expose that evil man, Anthony, for his wrongdoings. You see, my husband still hasn't woken up since he ate there. <laughs> I just don't know what else I can do. Um, please help me. Uh, yeah, uh, okay, um, and don't cry. Don't cry. Everything's gonna be okay. You know, I didn't realize it was that serious with your husband. I I'm really sorry that he hasn't woken up yet. Uh, um, oh gosh, okay, I don't want to promise this girl anything, but I don't know what I can do here. Um, but, you know, if it was that serious and he really is poisoning people, then maybe... I... <sighs> Look, you know what? Um, I, I, I can't promise that I'll be able to expose him, but I will at least try and uh, find out the truth on what's actually happening, okay? Just, uh, just stop crying. <laughs> really? You will? <laughs> yes, yes, you just gotta, you gotta stop crying and I am totally gonna help you out. I guess the only thing I can do is just kind of try and ask this guy straight up, like if, if, you know, I don't really have any other clues. Um, okay, I guess he's in there. Uh, <clears throat> hey. <coughs> Hello, how may I help you today? Uh, yeah, I was actually just wondering, uh, could I maybe ask you some questions? Just for a second, I swear it, it won't take very long. Uh, sure, I guess. So, um, I, you know, uh, maybe, uh, heard some rumors that, um, uh, there's some people who think you're poisoning the food. Is that true? Rumors? <laughs> Ugh. People will do anything to ruin my fine establishment. My food is the best in all of Bloxburg. Right! Okay, um, so... Those idiots are just too dumb to realize it's their cooking and not mine. Okay, clearly we are not gonna get anywhere with this guy, so, um, maybe I'm wasting my time. Uh, thanks anyways for, uh, answering those questions, um, I, I gotta get going. Now I want you to know that I would never poison my customers. Have a good day. Yeah, yeah, uh, sure, okay, whatever. I mean, I don't know if this guy's capable of like poisoning people, but he's definitely way too arrogant for my taste. I definitely don't really like him that much, but I can't just be jumping to conclusions, so I guess I need to start somewhere else. Uh, let's see. Oh. Hey, you! Uh, me? Okay. Uh, yeah, what can I uh, do for you, sir? 
you uh you've been you've been digging up any dirt on Anthony? The the chef guy in there? Uh I mean I wouldn't know I don't know if I'd really call it like digging up dirt. He didn't really tell me anything, but I guess yeah, I was asking him some questions. He is not a good person. Um really? Why why do you say that? He hurts anyone that intimidates him. Wait. Especially the rich husbands. How, how do you know all of this? Wait, did, where are you getting all your information from? Uh, oh no, I said too much. Wait, what? What the heck? What? Okay, maybe that guy was just crazy. I don't know, but this might be too much of a coincidence. Maybe there's some type of truth in what he's saying? I don't know, but um, I think now I really have to find out what the heck is going on here. Terry, I look ridiculous. You know this. I am not good at lying, okay? I told the dude that I had to take care of a beaver. It's okay. I just, I need you to do this. There's, I, I don't know. I'm gonna trust my gut here. I feel like there's something going on. I think your hangry self and the crazy lady is getting to you. No, it is not, okay? You, I told you all the things that happened. Do, do you know the plan? You go in there. All you have to do is distract Anthony and be a health inspector. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the plan. Yeah, I got the badge. Okay. Oh. This will you be ready? fine, and I owe you one. Yeah, you definitely do. Okay, just get in the car. All right, you know the plan? Yes, I know the plan. Okay, okay I'm just, just making sure. Don't get caught, We've got please. one chance at this, all right? You better keep him distracted. I know, okay? I'll I'll, I'll ping you in chat when, it, when it's time to go, okay? Okay, got it. Oh, you're so annoying. Okay, so uh, it looks like I am solo. Uh, oh God, okay, it's time for me to lie and just, uh, just kind of figure out uh, how we're gonna do this. Uh, this is a little nerve wracking here. Oh, okay, 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 I need to stay hidden. Maybe I should move my car back. I don't know, I'm really nervous right now. I don't, I normally don't get this nervous when it comes to like snooping, but something about this guy, I just don't like. I'm gonna see if I can see. Hello, how may I help you tonight? Oh, oh, I can see them over there. Uh, hi, uh, I am here to do uh, routine health inspector checks. I would like to check out your restaurant. It looks like everything's going well, but um, I don't know. A routine health inspection? That's right, and you have to listen because I have a badge, and if you don't listen, I will shut this place down, buddy. Examine my restaurant? Uh, okay. Look. Okay, I've heard the rumors about this place, all right? If you just, you know, I don't know, follow my instructions, I'll let you pass, okay? Yo, I'm, I'm a little busy and uh, don't really want to be working in the first place. Oh, come on, Dylan, this is taking too long. We have to speed this up. Where's my cue? Feel free to look around, okay? Mm. No, no, you're gonna follow me because I need you to follow me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Come on, Dylan, give me the cue. Give me the cue. I need to go look around. Let's go upstairs, okay? I, I heard there was an upstairs. Yeah, come on. Let's 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 go up here. Let's look at the dining area stuff here. Oh, are these are uh, these are these your bathrooms? Oh, oh, they're moving around. Oh, where are they? Where are they? Where are they going? Where are they going? Oh, oh! Go! Oh, tell me where to go! Tell me to go! Okay, okay. I think this is the back door. Um, come on, let me in. Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, these are the restrooms. Okay, well, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and go inside this one. Let's, uh, let's go check out how clean this one is. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Oh, oh, this is the room. This is the room. Okay. Um, I think this is where I should be. Wait, are they upstairs right now? It's looking pretty clean. Uh, hey, you see this corner wall right here? Sir? Sir, come over here. Is that a mouse? Is that a mouse that I see? Okay, okay, maybe if I just, uh, it's gotta be something in the kitchen, right? Oh, uh, sir, I was about to let you off with a warning and just pass you, but I hate rodents. This place isn't even, uh, like, it doesn't even look like anyone's even cooked in here. I mean, there's some frying oil, but it is spotless. What the heck? Okay, no, definitely no one would be, like, I don't know, getting sick from anything in this kitchen. That uh, appears to be a mouse. Yes. Oh my gosh, I am about to shut this place down. Unless, this is a nice place. You probably make some money, right? This is the cleanest, this is cleaner than Dylan's kitchen. 
gosh, I can see the usernames up there. Um, I gotta find something. Come on, Dylan's gonna be so mad at me if there's nothing. Let me just, anything in the cabinets? Y yeah. How about this? Slide me like 200 bucks and we'll, we'll forget this ever happened. $200? Well, look, buddy, you want your place to get shut out or what? No, nothing in there. For the money, buddy. I appreciate it. Now, let's go look at the rest of this place. Oh, God. I hope Carrie is actually doing good. Oh, God. Okay, bathroom number two. I need to close this behind me. I can't believe this. I can't believe this. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Okay. What the heck is this? Secret room thing? Oh, no. What? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh, 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 oh my God. Oh, that smells terrible. Wait, hold on, I gotta check this out. Okay, okay, oh, this is the poison. There was, wait, a, a million can were right. The, the, he has been poisoning people. I can't believe this. Oh my gosh, okay. I, I gotta expose this guy before he keeps making people sick. And, and I gotta get me and Dylan out of here. Oh. Get out! You're fired! And you'll never work at any restaurant ever again! How dare that stupid chef fire me! I, I'll start my own restaurant and become rich! And I know exactly how to do it! Holy cow, a new restaurant just opened up right across the street from my house. Wait, the sign says five-star restaurant, cheap prices. How the heck does a five-star restaurant have cheap prices? It looks so fancy. Maybe I'll check this place out and see how good this food really is, if it's actually cheap. Holy cow, this place looks crazy. Oh, that must be the chef. Okay, I'm just gonna say, uh, hi. Table for one, please. Oh, he just said, oh, hello, and welcome to my restaurant. Uh, hi. I didn't expect him to come around the counter. You can sit anywhere you want. I'm just gonna say, uh, awesome, thanks. Normally places like this have like a hostess or something. Whoa, I know it said on the sign five-star restaurant, but this is actually insane. I even got little flowers. Oh, he just said, are you ready to eat? Sure, um, what do you have? I don't have a menu. He just said, great, I'll make you a sampler platter. Whoa, 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 whoa. He said, we serve the best food here and it's the cheapest in town uh, uh, uh okay oh he's already running off holy cow i'm getting an entire sampler platter maybe since they're saying that all the food is super cheap it'll just be like some really fancy hot dogs i don't know or maybe it'll just be something plain like a frozen pizza oh he's coming out with a whole platter what holy cow he just put down an entire platter of salmon pecan pie a salad and ribs this is a really good salad i'm not gonna lie holy cow this is so good oh he just said how is everything great but i'm also gonna say how much is all this i mean this is a ton of food this is literally so much food and just for me he just said haha all this wonderful food is only five dollars wait seriously the ribs and the pie and the salmon and all of it five dollars just said yep how the heck is it so cheap that, that doesn't make any sense. Oh, he, he just said, it's a secret. Don't ask questions. Okay, my, my bad, I guess. Why did he just get so intense? What the heck? Oh, he just said, anyway, looks like you're done. Have a nice day. Hold on, wait, seriously? I I, I wasn't done eating. Um, uh, uh, hold on, I didn't, I, I didn't even pay. I mean, I wasn't done eating, but here, five dollars, I guess. Is that really all I have to pay you? Oh, he just said, great, thanks, bye now. Oh, okay, I guess he is literally like pushing me out the door. Can I at least get a to-go box, man? Jeez, fine, I'll leave. Whoa, whoa, this lady just ran in. She said, please help, I can't find my son. Huh? She just said the last time I saw him was when we ate here. Wait, seriously? The chef Robert just said, no, no one's seen your dumb kid. Oh my gosh, I'm getting out of the middle of this. Wait, why is he being so mean to her? Here you make a scene in my restaurant. Get out, get out. Holy cow, she just said, please help. He's literally kicking her out right now. He was so mean to her. What the heck? He just said, all right, have a nice day. Yeah, thanks, dude. What was that? That was so suspicious. She said the last time she saw her son was when she was eating here and he just kicked her out. I wonder if Chef Robert's hiding something. I put on my disguise and it's about 9 p.m. So the restaurant should have just closed. I'm gonna tail Chef Robert and see if he does anything suspicious after hours. 
Oh, there he is, there he is. Okay, he's getting in his car. And follow him around in my, uh, hopefully not noticeably pink moped. Don't mind me, just following him. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. He's pulling in somewhere, he's pulling in somewhere. Is he just at his house? I need a closer look. I'm getting, I'm going in closer, I'm going in closer. Oh, wait, he just said in chat, hi, dear, I'm home. Oh, and Sarah said, oh, you're home. Oh, Sarah, that must be his wife. Hi, dad. Oh, he has a son. Oh, there they are. It's not suspicious at all. It's honestly kind of wholesome. I don't know. There's still something weird about this guy. Maybe there's something going on at the restaurant. New plan. I am going to go in this restaurant and I am going to get a job. Hello, I would like to work here. Really? Yes, I'll be a great Employee. Oh, he just said, hmm, well, I could use some help. Let's have an interview. Okay, good with me. So, have you ever worked in a restaurant before? Well, no, I haven't. Good enough, you're hired. That was crazy. One question, and I honestly didn't even answer it that well, but I'll take it. Oh, he just said, let me show you around. Okay, let's see. I mean, uh, I guess he doesn't recognize me from yesterday because I've definitely already been here to eat, but... All right, I'm ready to see the back end of this restaurant. He just said, this is the lobby. Here's all the tables. I mean, this place is still really nice. He keeps it really clean. Oh, and this must be the kitchen. Kind of huge. He just said, this is our main kitchen. I'm just gonna say, uh, it's really nice. Are, are you the only one here? This kitchen is huge. And it doesn't really look like a whole bunch of these stoves are being used. What the heck? Uh, yeah. Why is he being so hesitant? Oh, he just said, well, now there's you. Uh, good point. He just said, uh, so anyway. Okay, that was really strange. All I asked is if he was the only one working here. Something is definitely weird. Oh, a customer. This will be good. This will be good. I'll see if he's being weird to any of the customers. Oh, oh, they're coming to sit down. They're coming to sit down. I'm going back to the kitchen. I need to add completely normal here because if Chef Robert gets any hint that I am being sneaky, he might fire me. Oh, oh, hello, Chef. Oh, he just said, all right, we have an order. I got it. I'm, I'm ready to start cooking. Our customer would like a pizza. Oh, pizza, yes. Okay, I can do that. Um, Let me just say, uh, where are the recipes so I can like, you know, get started. Today's food is already made, but you'll learn the recipes soon enough. Um, okay, uh, okay, I, I got it. I guess I'll just grab the pizza from the fridge? I'm so confused. Um, oh, here we go. Yep, he's already got a pizza in here. Here you go, one pizza. He said, good work. Okay, wait. Maybe he like did something to the pizza? Hold on, I'm gonna try and be like really not suspicious here and just watch. Oh, customer just said, oh wow, that looks delicious, thanks. Hold on, let's see, is he gonna eat it? Is he gonna eat it? Come on, he, there's no way he made all of that food all night long by himself. I saw him go home. What is going on here? Oh, he's eating the pizza. Oh, is he gonna like, I don't know, blow up or something? What did he do to the food? Oh, oh, the customer just said that was delicious, thanks. And he paid him in. Okay, nothing happened. Literally nothing. Oh, 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 Chef Robert's coming back. Oh, he just said, all right, Carrie, I have some work to do outside the restaurant. So I'm gonna have to have you watch over for a couple hours. Uh, oh, okay, uh, yeah, uh, sure thing, boss. You got it. I'm so confused. What is going on here? I have been looking around and I still don't see anything suspicious going on. There's like nothing in these cabinets either. That's kind of weird for a kitchen. Maybe I'm just overthinking things? I don't know. I thought this guy was suspicious, but I haven't found anything that's going on. And wait, hold on. There's someone in the lobby who's literally yelling. I, oh, oh, he just said, hello, where is the restaurant owner? Where is that chef? You! Uh, uh, uh me? Uh, what about me? Oh no, this is not good. He seems angry. He just said, where is my kid? I know you know where my kid is. Wait, wait, what? I, I uh, um, he just said, where is he? Um, I don't know. He it's my first day! I, oh, oh, there's the chef! He just said, hey, stop that! Oh gosh, this seems bad, this seems bad! He said, nobody talks to my employees like that! I mean, thanks, I guess? Wait, the dad just said, you, you took my son! <gasps> Wait, he did what? This is crazy! He just said, nobody knows anything about your dumb kid! Get out of my restaurant! Wait, no, he's kicking him out again after another missing kid? He just said, ugh, I'm going to the police! The police? Holy cow, holy cow, this seems serious. I, I'm just gonna say, uh, thanks, thanks for that. Um, he did kind of break up the fight that was happening there, but this is the second time a parent has run in here screaming about a lost kid? He said, are you okay? Yep, um, 
All good. Uh -huh. You know the customer service industry. You never know what you're gonna get. There's definitely something weird about that. Where are all these children going? Gonna, gonna get back to work. Okay, there is definitely something suspicious going on here. Why did two parents come in here saying that the chef took their kid? All right, I'm back in my sneaky outfit and I am going to break into this restaurant after hours. Just have to wait for the chef to go home. Oh, there he is, there he is. He's getting in his car. Okay. There he goes, there he goes. Good, good, this is my chance, this is my chance. I've gotta get in here and see what the heck is going on in this place and seriously, he didn't even lock the door? Okay, okay, you know what? This is the first time I've had to really look around in every single crevice and cabinet and find something suspicious. Cause it doesn't make any sense for those parents to come in here and scream about their missing kids and blame it all on the chef for there to be nothing going on. And for some reason, I don't know, it weirds me out that the kitchen is so clean all the time. Okay, okay, let's see, let's see. This is supposedly his office. There's always something weird in the office. Okay, this is a fancy office. Come on, I'm looking for secret floors, secret doors. I don't know, maybe like a, a diary that talks about how he, he hates people who eat food or something. Literally, there's nothing in here. He must not spend very much time in here. Okay, that's weird. Um, I didn't see anything in the kitchen earlier, but I've got to give it another look. Nothing in these cabinets. Seriously, what the heck? I've gotta find something. There's no way this is just a normal restaurant and that is just a normal dude. I am literally opening every single cabinet. Why, there's no food up here. That doesn't make any sense. Oh no, that open sign is not for the cabinet. There is a secret door. Okay, okay, this is it. I found whatever is weird behind this door. Oh no, it looks like a dungeon. This is bad. Okay, here we go. Oh, oh my gosh, wait. Kids, why, why are there kids in a crazy prison cell down here? What the, wait, this little girl just said, OMG, a person. And the little boy said, ma'am, please help us. Hold on, uh, what is going on? What are they doing down here? It's literally nighttime, what? I am so confused. All these doors are completely locked in. Hold on, is this a second kitchen? And it's so gross, what the heck? Wait, Adam just said, the chef, he kidnapped us and he's making us cook all the food. What? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, why would he do that? That doesn't make any sense. Oh no, Adam just said I miss my dad. Wait, wait, there's two kids in here and two parents ran in here saying they were missing the kids. This must be their missing kids. Holy cow, I'm putting all the pieces together. Adam just said he only forces us to cook the food so he doesn't have to spend all that money. <gasps> That's how he makes all the food so cheap. And I mean, well, the kids can't cook. But that, that is not the point. I have got to get you kids out of here. Uh, do you know where a key is? Normally they have some type of idea. The chef keeps the keys on him. Well, that makes things more difficult. Oh gosh, what am I gonna do? Come on, and he open. Wait, I just got an idea. It's risky, but it might work. Don't worry kids, I'm coming back for ya. Oh no, the mom just said, hey you, where's my child? Why are we here? Oh no, and the dad said, you're that chef from the other day. Where are our kids? Um, I, uh, oh gosh, oh gosh, wait, the mom just said, give me my child. Oh, I didn't really think this through. I need the chef to come out quickly. I hope this plan works. Oh gosh, oh gosh, the dad just came up to me and said, tell us why we're here now. Oh gosh, they're getting really, really mad. Oh, oh, there's the chef. Oh, he just said, what's going on out here? Who's fighting in front of my restaurant? There he is. Get him. <laughs> oh gosh, the chef just said, what is this? What's going on? I'll be taking this, thank you. Oh, the chef just said, hey, my key. All right, here's the thing, Mr. Chef. I know your whole plan, dude, okay? I'm getting those kids. Okay, okay, this is my chance, this is my chance before he gets up and starts chasing me. I have gotta go free those little kids. Don't worry, guys, I am coming for you. Kids, I'm coming. Oh gosh, oh gosh, there they are, there they are. And I got the door unlocked. Oh, oh, Adam just said, ma'am, you came back. Dana said, thank you. All right, here you go, guys. Um, Your mom and dad are upstairs. All right, come on, guys, let's get you the heck out of here. And you will never have to cook another meal for a very, very, very long time. And definitely not for this guy. All right, here they are. Oh, Adam just said, dad, I'm okay. 
Okay, I just said, there you go. And the police are on the way. That's him. That's the guy. Oh, oh, Officer Goody just said, you're going to jail for a long time. Oh, he just said, I can't believe you made those kids make all your food for the restaurant. Oh, Officer Goody's mad. Oh, he just said, you won't be running another restaurant anytime soon. Chef Robert just said, we could have been rich if you didn't interfere. Ah, whatever. Um, you don't deserve to be rich, dude. Have fun in jail. Oh, and there they go. <laughs> you won't get away with this. Oh, uh, well, I think I already did. Today I was in Bloxburg and saw a restaurant for girls only. I went to check it out and saw a guy getting yelled at by the owner. She called him an idiot and said that all boys are stupid. I wanted to see why she hates boys so much, so I have got to check this place out. Holy cow, that girl was so mean to this dude. He is running away from her right now. Jeez Louise. Okay, guys, I've got to figure out why she hates boys so much. I mean, maybe that guy, like, did something really mean to her? I don't know. Okay, guys, I'm going to go check it out right now. Let's see if she's any nicer to me. I'm just going to say, um, hey, uh, is everything okay with that guy? She said that boy wanted a job, but he's a boy, so he's obviously too stupid to work here. Uh, wait, she screamed at him and did all that just because he applied for a job? She must really hate boys then. I mean, that's really intense. But I guess it is a uh, girls-only restaurant, so maybe I'm not that surprised, but still. She said, actually, I'm looking for a new waitress. And since you're a girl, you're the perfect candidate. Wait, uh, guys, I literally didn't even come here to apply. She just said, want a job? Okay, uh, I was not expecting this. She said, we pay really well. Guys, I just wanted to check out what was going on with this whole like argument situation with that guy. But girls and boys only places always seem like a red flag to me. And this is kind of a perfect way to investigate. You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to say, um, sure. Why not? Okay, guys, we are gonna see what the heck is going on here. And it's pretty easy now that I literally just got a job. Stephanie said, perfect, come with me. Oh, okay, we're starting right now. Well, this was not my plan for today, but this restaurant actually is really pretty and it just looks like a super fancy restaurant. Stephanie said, you need to meet our head chef. She's in the kitchen. Oh, uh, okay. Um, oh, 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 I think I see the kitchen back here and wait, is that the head chef? Um, okay, Chef Gretchen is buff. That is a strong woman. Uh, I'm just gonna say hi, I'm, I'm Carrie. Uh, the new hire. He said, welcome to the team. I'm so glad you're a girl. Uh, uh, me too? I, I don't know. She said, if they hired a boy, I would have had to beat him up. What the heck, you guys? These girls are so intense. Why do they hate boys so much? I'm gonna play along and just be like, ha ha. Well, I'm, I'm not a boy, so no, no need to beat me up. She's really scary. Stephanie, she said, Carrie. We have customers. Please go take their orders. Huh? No, I, I just started. I haven't even been trained. Uh, okay, I guess I have to do the job. Um, Time to be a waitress, she said. You got this, girly. Oh, okay, sure I do. I don't really know what I got, but I guess it's time to be a waitress. Okay, guys, I got on my waitress uniform and I can see the two customers. Okay, it's uh, Madeline and Margo. I'm honestly not surprised that the customers are girls. Madeline said, OMG, this restaurant is just adorbs. Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, I'm gonna try and do my best here. I don't even know what's on the menu. Hi, ladies. Uh, what can I get you? Hopefully they pick something simple. Margo said, hello. And Madeline said, hey girl, love your hair. Uh, no, thank you. These girls are very friendly. Madeline said, we'll both have the chef's special, please. Margo said, yeah, that sounds wonderful. I'm going to say, okay, uh, you got it. I'm going to pretend like I know what the chef's special is. And you know what? Fake it till you make it. Oh, oh, and there is Gretchen. Uh, two chef specials. She said, coming right up. All right, I should have some time here to kind of calm down a little bit. I'm feeling really nervous, you guys. Okay. Huh? Wait. Is, is that it? She said, here you go. I mean, 
That was really quick. She just grabbed these from the fridge. How did she have them already ready? They actually look perfect, but uh, how did you do that? What the heck? She said, that's none of your business. Go bring those girls their food. Now? Uh, okay. Got, got it. Jeez, why did Gretchen get so aggressive when I asked how she cooked all of that? Guys, I don't know. Something about that felt really off. I mean, luckily, these customers are happy with their food, but Gretchen told totally switched up her mood on me and I I knew something suspicious was going on here at this restaurant but I feel like Gretchen is definitely hiding something too okay guys I have been working here all day long and I haven't really had any time to investigate but now it is finally my lunch break so I'm gonna try and look around a little bit and hopefully then I'll be able to find some um oh, uh, Hello? Krista said, excuse me, uh, have you seen my boyfriend anywhere here? Um, I'm just gonna say, uh, sorry, this is a girls only restaurant. I feel kind of bad, like, promoting this place, but I don't want to get fired, so she said, well, he's a chef, and he recently applied here. Wait, 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 like the guy from this morning? She said, but I haven't seen him since then. He must have been the one getting yelled at, but I was pretty sure he just ran off. Off, she said and I'm really worried um I don't want to say that I like don't know anything I'm just gonna say um I haven't seen him but I'll ask my boss okay maybe she knows like where he ran off to uh hi Stephanie she said hey do you need something Carrie uh so there's a, a girl out front asking about her um boyfriend have you seen him I I think she said he was missing or something she said oh Maybe he ghosted her. Boys are trash. He's not here. Um, okay, you guys. Uh, like I said, I was already kind of nervous, but she really shut that down very quickly. That was very suspicious. She just said, anything else? Nope, that's it, that's it. Okay, okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, geez, okay. Um, something about that felt really weird to me. Why did she just shut it down so quickly? Krista said, is he here? Uh, I'm just gonna say sorry. Um, I, I don't think so. Krista said, okay, I have his location and it says he's here. Wait, seriously? Okay, I don't know. I mean, if she's got his location, then there's no way like the GPS would lie. I am like 100% confident now that there is something going on here. And I think I have an idea. Whatever is going on at this secret restaurant, the only place that I haven't been able to really look around in is the kitchen. So it has got to be something back there. But first, I have got to get Gretchen and Stephanie out of the building. Okay, I am just going to whisper to Krista and say, listen, I have a plan, but I think I need your help, okay? I need you to cause a crazy scene, like get loud, act wild, and run out. Okay, I'm hoping if she gets crazy enough, Gretchen and Stephanie will follow her out. She said, I got this, I'm a professional, I am crazy. Wait, what? You know what guys, I'm not gonna question it. Uh. Do your thing, girl! Okay, guys, I just served Krista some food, and now it is time for her to start the distraction. I'm not exactly sure what she has in mind, but hopefully it is enough to cause a big enough scene. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, Krista is up on the table. She said, disgusting! This food is terrible! She said, what is this garbage? Guys, she is screaming on the table in a fancy restaurant. Oh, there's Stephanie and Gretchen. Oh my gosh. Stephanie said, what's going on? Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna play dumb right now, guys. I don't know what's happening, but oh, she is raging. She said, how dare you serve this trash? Gretchen said, get off that table. Ooh, you don't wanna mess with her. Krista said, this food is so bad. I'm reporting this to the cops. Oh gosh, she's a running, she's running. Stephanie said, ma'am, I'm gonna need you to calm down. No, wait, get back here. We need to stop her. Holy cow, Krista is on the run. Stephanie said, Carrie, watch the restaurant. I'm just gonna say, got it. And there they go, guys. They are chasing after Krista right now. Holy cow. I cannot believe she actually managed to clear the entire restaurant in a matter of 
12 seconds. Okay, this is perfect. This buys me plenty of time, I hope, to start investigating. All right, let's see what we can find. All right, it looks like the coast is still clear. So now it is time to start snooping. Let's see if there's anything in these cabinets. Wait, guys, it's a kitchen and there's no ingredients in here? What is, what the heck is this? What kind of kitchen is this? I mean, I know they have to have ribs. That's what I served the other people. And hot dogs, that's what I gave to Krista. So there should be stuff here. Why is there nothing? Okay, this is where they were getting all of the food. There's nothing on the racks. Gretchen was kind of over here in this corner a lot, but nope, still no ingredients. But guys, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. There is an open GUI on this fridge. Wait. Guys, it's a fake fridge. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is a fake fridge! Okay, coast is still looking clear. No way! Oh my gosh, guys, it was a secret door! I knew it! I knew I was right! I knew something was going on at this restaurant! And that it was hidden in the kitchen! Hopefully, Gretchen and Stephanie do not return very quickly. I don't know how long Chris is gonna keep them occupied for, because I do not want to get caught down here. Oh, geez, this is big. All right, guys, and now it is time to see what this girl's only restaurant was hiding. And honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. It's only one o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm already about to bust this place. I. What the heck is going on here? Oh, hey! Wait, that guy right there, that, that's the guy I saw this morning applying for a job. I swore he ran away. How the heck did he end up here? He said, we've been cooking all day. Please, can we have a break? I, I don't know who this other guy is, Wilson. Wait a second. He applied to be a chef and all the food came out really quickly. Has everything that's been served today been made by these guys? Wilson said, I can't believe we can't even eat any of the food. Oh my gosh, you guys, I cannot believe this. Uh, uh, okay, uh, listen, I, I'm not evil, all right? I'm here to help. Oh my gosh, they seem so upset, and which, which makes sense. They're being forced to cook. I can't believe this. Liam said, we've been trapped down here cooking all day. I just want to go home. And guys, who knows how long Wilson's been here? Liam just got here today. Don't worry, guys. I am going to get y'all out. Wilson said, I'm so hungry. I haven't slept in days. Luckily, the girls should be gone, and I'm handling this very quickly. So, no problem here. I am just going to let these guys out. Y'all just follow me, and then we will all get them out of here. I'll expose the restaurant. Wilson said, this isn't a trap, right? No, I swear, okay? I'm out actually helping. Why don't these boys ever trust me when I'm trying to get them out of cells? Just shut up and follow me, okay? All right, seems like the coast is still clear. Here we go. Easy peasy. All right, just follow me out and run for the door. No one else is here, so it shouldn't be any problem. Come on, you guys. Uh-oh, uh-oh, oh, uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh, -oh, uh retreat. Retreat! Stephanie said, Carrie, what are you doing with those boys? Um, Liam said, oh no, the big lady! Wilson said, I knew it was a trap! He said, we shouldn't have trusted this girl. Hey, I'm the only one helping you right now, so you should probably be nice to me. Okay, you know what? Fight it with the truth. I know your whole plan, okay? You can't force these guys to cook for you, okay? It's, it's, it's your restaurant. You should be the one cooking. Stephanie said, oh yeah? Of course we can. Boys are trash. Um, okay. Look, man, I don't know who hurt you, uh, but you definitely got some problems and I feel like you're projecting them onto me. I don't feel like this is my problem. I'm literally just here to help these guys. Oh, jeez. Gretchen said, no, boys, leave my kitchen. Go. Oh, no, 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 no. She's got a knife. Guys, she's got a knife. She's got a knife. I'm running back. I'm running back. My plan didn't work. Uh, my plan didn't work. Wilson said, dude, now what? I'm out of ideas. This lady scares me. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stephanie said, you could have had an easy job here and made lots of money, but now you're going to join those boys in the kitchen? What? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Um, We don't actually have another way out. We're kind of blocked. Liam said, don't worry. We've been cooking all day. We've got some tools, too. Wait. Huh? Wilson said, oh, yeah. Oh, my gosh, you guys. They both have knives out. Okay. <laughs> 3v1 now. What you going to do? Gretchen said, wait, boss. This isn't looking good. Oh, geez. I guess they didn't think about that. 
not when they gave their prisoners weapons. And when we get out of here, y'all are all getting arrested, okay? This restaurant is going down. Stephanie said, no way, I won't go down like this. You're on your own, chef. Oh my gosh, she just left Gretchen alone. Holy cow. Gretchen said, hey, wait for me. They're running, they're running, and the boys are chasing after them. Okay, you guys. I mean, I didn't plan on taking this job today, but I did get to take down some crazy people, and now Liam can meet back up with his girlfriend. So, successful! Okay, guys, I am back in Bloxburg, and today I'm in the mood to get a job. So, um, I think I'm just gonna hop right into it and go out to my car and, and look around and kind of see if I can find anything that looks relatively interesting. Hold on. Back up. What? Guys, there's literally a help wanted flyer at my door. What kind of coincidence? Okay, hold on. It literally says help wanted, new restaurant, chef, I guess, Pablamo? Pablano? I don't really know. Chef something. Uh, help wanted a new restaurant. Okay, um, I can't remember the last time I worked in a restaurant, you guys. It was probably a super long time ago, so I don't know. I guess I'll try that place first and hopefully it's not an old flyer we'll see if they're still hiring okay i'm pretty sure this is the place you guys i mean it's the only restaurant i can find so i i guess we'll check it out i mean it looks really fancy so hopefully i can get a job here um oh yep this is the place you guys that is chef pablino um he said welcome to my restaurant how may i help you today i'm gonna say um i saw your flyer um i am looking for a job i guess i mean any any job cook server whatever uh whatever you got i guess um it didn't really specify on the flyer what kind of thing he was hiring for so um i don't know that guys this is honestly probably a a, a pretty pretty far stretch he said oh perfect let's get down to business and i'll give you a quick interview oh okay that was fast um sounds good to me though that's fine i mean it seems like there's nobody else here so i'd be the only one he said do you have any previous waitress experience honestly you guys i can't remember i mean i feel like i probably do uh, i'm just gonna say um yes you know what i'll say yes but um a long time ago okay then it's not like totally a lie because i i really i really do think i have some just not sure when it was i can't remember he said are you a nice person and work well with others well there's not really any other people here so i don't see how working well with others really matters but i'm just gonna say yeah i mean i think i'm a nice person and i like to be around people so kind of works out yeah that makes sense to me i i think i'm telling the truth i think this interview is going well um, he said, great, last question. Do you like food? Duh. Uh, I think everybody likes food. I'm just gonna say, uh, yes, I love food. So, and and that's the last question? It's a pretty quick interview, I guess. He said, perfect, you're hired. Oh, oh, okay, right now, right now, that works. Um, I'm just gonna say, uh, okay, um, now, now what? I guess, do I get trained? Do I have a uniform? He said, Go ahead and change in the upstairs restroom. Oh, I'm gonna say, got it. I uh, said, I'll meet you in the kitchen. Okay, I guess that is where my training will start. I don't really know. All right, you guys, I think I look pretty waitressy right now. I'm feeling good. Um, okay, I'm just gonna say, um, so what do I do? Um, I still don't really know, like, what my job is, or if I'm gonna be cooking, serving. I don't know, he did ask if I had waitress experience, so I'm assuming maybe that. He said, oh, hey, welcome to my kitchen. I'm just gonna say thanks. Um, I mean, I kinda hope I'm not cooking, cause I'm not the best at it. He said, so today we'll be serving some very special guests. Okay, um, that's exciting. I guess on my first day to have like special people coming. Um, I'm just gonna say, uh, cool. I guess, um, I, I, I guess I'm here to, he said, you're here to make their experience, you're here to make their experience here the best. All right, I think I can do that. You know, I can be friendly, give them a good table, and I don't know, give them hopefully good food. I haven't tried this guy's cooking, so I'm hoping that it's a good restaurant. Um, that way I'm not, you know, selling bad food to people. But, I mean, everything looks pretty nice. He said, go ahead and famili familiarize yourself with the restaurant well, I cook the food. I'm just gonna say, okay. Um, I guess I'm gonna go 
look around. Um, the place is super nice. Um, got a lot of plants everywhere, a really nice front desk area, a lot of tables and windows, which is also really nice. All the tables are already set. And there's an upstairs that's also really nice with the bathrooms. It's got a balcony and everything. I don't know, you guys. This is like a really nice restaurant. Um, I mean, even the bathrooms are pretty nice, you guys. Like, look at this place. It's got plants, nice tile floor. Some pretty big windows in the bathroom, which is a little odd, but it's fine. It's whatever, right? Every table has its own little rug. I don't know, guys. I'm I'm pretty fond of this place. I feel really high end. My uniform is super nice and he provided all of it for me, which was a little weird that he had my size and everything, but like I don't know, I guess that's cool. And I don't know, I just I like this place. I'm excited to start working and I'm also excited to see who these special guests are. The chef said, "Okay, the guest should be here any minute." I'm going to say, "Okay, um I'll go to the front um and i guess greet them i guess i'm acting as like the host and the waitress i don't really know but you know what i can do all the things i can do all the things um let's see okay uh where is the chef is he he did say these were special guests so you know i think he would be coming to greet them too um oh oh, oh i think he's coming i think he's coming okay oh wait wait oh whoops guys they're here and they look really fancy there's brett chipman and chrissy jarvis okay uh they look soup i mean it's a fancy restaurant so i guess that yeah they dressed up uh chrissy said hey if it isn't little Pablino, long time no see and brett said well look who it is okay clearly they have been friends for a while um, the chef said, so nice to see you two. Uh, I feel a little awkward he hasn't introduced me, but it's okay. I mean, I guess I am just the, the waitress here. He said, man, I haven't seen you in ages. The chef said, thanks for showing up. I wonder where they met each other. I mean, it sounds like there are pretty, you know, long friends, whatever. He said, I can't believe our high school reunion is right around the corner. Oh, okay, guys, I guess they are high school friends. That's kind of sweet. Um, he said, the, this is the waitress. She'll be serving you two. Um... Okay, okay, I'm gonna say, um, hi, uh, welcome in, um, I'll show you to your seat. Okay, guys, I think I'm a pretty good waitress. Um, okay, okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and say, uh, follow me. The chef said, of course, you two are welcome to anything. I'm just gonna say, follow me. And you know what? I'm going to pick out what I think is the best table in the place. And honestly, it's pro I think I'm, I'm gonna say it's this one. Cause this has all the windows, it's really nice. I'm gonna say, uh, take a seat and I'll get you some water. Okay, um, and I will be back super quickly with both of those waters because I am the best waitress. All right, here we go. And like I said, I mean, they all seem like really friendly. I mean, this place is pretty simple. I guess it just opened um, because I don't know, it, it's, he's talking about how like these are his special guests. Um, whoa, Brett just said, you know, it's pretty crazy. He actually did something for once. And wow, like look at this place. What What is that supposed to mean that he did something? I thought they were friends. She's, they're like surprised that he has a nice restaurant. Um, he said, she said, I can't believe Poblano did something. He said, I'm a bit impressed actually. That's a little passive aggressive, you guys. Um. While I'm standing like right here, I'm just gonna say, um, can I get you something? Like, I mean, I guess your orders, um, anything on the menu, I guess. I don't, I'm a little, I'm a little sketched out by these guys. Brett said, oh, hey, yeah, we are starving. How about this? Why don't you bring us out anything that Poblino can make that's decent, lol. Guys, I, I don't even know how to respond to that. Uh. I'm just gonna say, um, okay, I'll, I'll get, uh, I don't know, uh, they said, yeah, anything that's good. I'm gonna say I'll get the chef's recommendation, I guess. I, 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 I don't really know. They're kind of rude. They said, perfect, thanks. Maybe, maybe I should tell the chef what's going on? Um, okay, I'm just gonna say, uh, hey, so they're asking, I don't know, for anything decent i don't know I, like is that an inside joke or something I, I don't know maybe they're just like trying to kid um uh, oh gosh i totally misspelled decent though i mean i misspell everything but like whatever um there i'll just correct it myself 
Um, I mean, I don't know, maybe they're just trying to like be lighthearted because they're friends with him. He said, oh, that's how they talk, haha. -ha. They talk with insults? Cause that doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. He said, it's totally normal. That works, I guess. Um, so what should I serve? I mean, did he have something prepared or I don't know, is he gonna make something on the fly? I, I, I don't really know what I'm supposed to give them. They didn't actually order anything off the menu. He said, why don't you go ahead and bring out the food? It's stored and ready in the fridge. Oh, okay. Oh, I guess they had pre-ordered the salmon. I mean, that's fine. I guess salmon's a pretty fancy meal. All right, I'll just go ahead and bring this out and hopefully they don't say anything else weird because even if it's normal for him, I, I don't think I really, I don't know. I don't really know how to react to that kind of stuff. So I'm just gonna say uh, enjoy. That's definitely not how any of my friends chalk or anything. They just said, oh wow, salmon. Okay, they seem surprised. This looks pretty good, actually. Well, yeah, it is a fancy restaurant. I guess I'll just let them be. I don't know, weird friendship, I guess. It's finally time to clean up, you guys. They stayed here for quite a while, but um, they didn't eat very much. So I guess I'll just take this back to the kitchen. I don't know, throw it out. Again, like we didn't have any other customers, which is a little odd, but maybe it's like a new thing. I don't really know. Um. Just gonna put it in the sink, I guess. And uh, okay, uh, chef said, hey, thanks so much for your hard work tonight. I'm just gonna say, um, of course, I guess. Um, I mean, I served one table, so it wasn't that difficult. I guess all they had was water and then some salmon. Hardly any of it though, so I don't know, but at least they ate some. That's good. Said, I really appreciate you making our guests feel so welcome. I'm gonna say, uh, no, no problem. Uh, I don't know, I mean, I guess it was fun. He said, see you first thing tomorrow morning. Oh, okay, that sounds good. Maybe we'll actually have like some more people. This may have just been like an opening night or something. I don't really know, but at least I have a job. I just finished opening. It is almost 7.30 in the morning and I've just been kind of chilling, waiting for anyone to come in. Maybe there's like a breakfast menu or something. I don't really know, but I'm, I'm feeling good. Um, you know, last night was slow, but hey, that that's the guy from last night. I'm just gonna say, uh, hey, uh, welcome. I guess, um, oh, he said you, what? He said, I'm suing you, wait, what? What, why, I, I, what is he talking about? He's suing me, I just started working here. He said, how dare you? Wait, I'm literally just gonna throw some question marks. I have no idea what he's talking about, you guys, what? He said, that, that girl that was with me last night is now in the hospital. Um, he said, it's all because of the food you served us. Wait, I, I, I didn't do anything. I didn't even touch that food. I just brought it to you. What? He said, what did you do to that food, huh? I'm just gonna say, um, I, I, I didn't touch it. Um, maybe how it's cooked? Maybe he, I don't know, it was the first night or something. Maybe he didn't cook it all the way through. He said, it had to have been you. Pablino doesn't have the guts to ruin anything for us. What does that even mean? What, and, and I, do? Um, uh, uh, I, I didn't touch it. I really, I really didn't. He said, you'll be hearing from my lawyers. What is he talking about? He said, I swear you'll pay for this. Wh <laughs> what? Okay, I'm just gonna go ask the chef. Maybe he knows like what happened. Um, I'm just gonna say, hey, um, did you hear that guy? I, I mean, he had to have heard it. The guy was literally yelling at me. Um, is everything okay with the food? He just said, what happened? Uh, I'm gonna say he said his girl is sick. I don't, I don't really know. Um, he only served the salmon though. So I don't, I don't know what else is on the menu or what else, maybe it was something in the water. I, I have no idea, but whatever it is, he thinks I did it. So, um, I, 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 I don't even know. I'm gonna say, um, he blamed me. He said, oh, that's too bad. Hope she recovers soon. What, what do you mean? What do you mean? You, that's too bad. Okay, if it's something with the food, we both know that wasn't me. He said, well, did you do anything? Oh, what? No, I would literally never do that. What do you mean? Did I do anything? He said, well, if you didn't do anything, then you shouldn't worry about it. Okay, guys. How is he so calm? I mean, that's a, a little sus. I'm just gonna say, oh, uh, okay. I, what is 
going on with this guy? Okay, guys, so the chef is really being very suspicious, so he's out on his lunch break right now, and I think I'm gonna go snoop around the kitchen or something, you know, and see if there's anything really going on here, because I don't understand why he would have been so, like, nonchalant about the fact that, like, some of his customers literally got sick. Um, I'm just gonna open some cabinets. I mean, nothing is sitting out, really. Nothing even looks dirty. So I'm a little confused. Um, okay, there's nothing down there. Um, nothing up there either. What the heck? What is going on? What? Well, that's something, okay? He has like seven bottles of poison in his pantry. Guys, he's literally been poisoning his, his customers. That was why she got sick. I can't believe he tried to act like nothing happened. I'm so confused. I mean, he's got like... An entire rack. You, I have no idea what any of this stuff is. I mean, I know I said I don't really cook, but it's it. Nothing I cook with has ever looked like. No, oh, no, oh no, 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 no. He said, "What are you doing in my kitchen without permission?" Um. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna confront him. I'm gonna say, "Why did you poison them?" Like, what? What is going on? What do you mean? Why I'm in here? Probably because. People are getting sick eating your food, man. He said, what are you talking about? I'm gonna say, this poison, you, I mean, you did that, what do you mean? Um, I mean, especially having like, no wonder he only had one customer. He literally just asked them to come. He said, fine, fine, you caught me. Those people last night, they bullied me in high school. Uh, but why would he invite them here if they did that? I, what about it? He said they asked me to cook for them and give them money. I mean, okay, man, that's kind of sad, but I, I still have to call the cops. You can't just poison people. I'm just gonna say I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, I, I still have to call the cops. He said so. Last night was my opportunity to get back at them. What by putting one of them in the hospital? I think that's a little bit harsh. Like, wait, is that why that that was on my? He just, that's not why that note was on my front door. He said, haha, that's funny. I'll never get caught. What, um, yes, you will. I, I literally, I saw you. I, what do you mean? Was he, hold on a second. Is that why nobody else works here? He said, now I have a picture of you next to the bottle. They'll never suspect it was me. Good luck. Hey, wait, hey, wait. 